Hi, my name is Hugo Guerre, and I'm a director and visual effects supervisor working professionally since 1999. I know that a lot of you are feeling nervous about the current explosion of AI, and I don't blame you. I'm also concerned about the future and creative industry, since certain companies seem to be a bit obsessed about replacing artists. But in my opinion, it's not that simple, and I think artists are not going anywhere. We've been in similar crosswords before, and we've always adapted and evolved. I'm old enough to have witnessed both the transition from film to digital, and also the shift from analog editing to digital editing on a computer. At that time, we also had an explosion of opinions about how cinema was going to die. But the reality was that the advancements in technology made our creative process better and not worse. Back in the early 2000s, it would have taken me weeks to edit a short music video. And now with digital editing, I can do it in days and sometimes even hours. My point is AI could be used to help us. And the reality is that AI is not going anywhere. It is here to stay and it will definitely disrupt the visual effects industry. It will fast track pipelines and the core skills that make a good art artist will not change. We'll still need to know what a good image is and what a good edit is. The core artistic knowledge is more important than ever. My advice then to everyone is to be agnostic. Learn about lighting, composition, storytelling and editing and you will manage to use any software available at any time, regardless if it's traditional visual effects tools or machine learning or AI. Just remember that AI is just another tool. Try to ignore all these tech bros and AI evangelists. Ignore the doom and gloom, since most of them only exist to drive company valuation up and to get exit strategies. Don't believe the hype. Use responsible ethical source AI. Never stop learning and make art. Don't stop. Remember, painters did not stop painting because of photography. They went on to create impressionism and form the foundations of modern art. Be a revolutionary and not a reactionary. Anyway, that's just my humble opinion. See you on the next video.